I don't really use much build CC in The Sims 4. Well, I don't really use any build CC for The Sims 4. I honestly don't really use any cast custom content either. I mostly just play vanilla, but that does not mean I don't have a good appreciation for some high quality CC. And you guys, I think that mod creators might save the world. You won't even believe what I'm gonna show you in a second, okay? Because these people, these people are so talented. <laughs> it makes me feel bad about myself. Are you seeing this? The bathroom. <laughs> it's a custom content stuff pack. The art for it is beautiful. The items are beautiful. You can see some previews for all the things they've made here. Oh my god. And we're gonna download this and look at all of them and and weep genuinely. Because are you seeing this? <laughs> I'm so excited. Right now it's only on Patreon. It's five dollars for early access. It comes out for real for the public on February 5th. I just paid some money for it because this is a very high quality stuff pack and I was ready. But I'll link the posts about it. I'll link both the creators down below. Please check out their stuff because I mean they have this kitchen stuff pack as well. I made a video on this a few months ago. It's genuinely so beyond impressive. <laughs> so if you haven't seen it, come on. You, I mean, oh my god, the pictures even. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted. Let's download this. Here we go, kids. Oh, 82 items, by the way. <laughs> oh my god. Small CC pack, just just a couple things, just, just a few, yeah. The kitchen pack genuinely made me want to start using build CC, like on a regular basis. I still won't, because most of the builds that I do, I make for the gallery for you guys to download, and having CC kind of makes that difficult, but like, again, doesn't mean that I can't appreciate a good bathtub every once in a while. <laughs> Hurry up, get, this is a, um, a nice small bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> we can use this to decorate and, and look at and stuff. I believe we've got some windows. So let's look at them first. I'm so happy. Wait, okay. So they come in pieces. So you can make as big of a window as you want and it has no panes. Why hasn't The Sims done this? Like, why don't we have this actually in the game? Cause you can make like basically a glass wall. Oh my God. <laughs> Wait, you literally could make a glass wall like this. I just made a full glass wall. <laughs> this is genuinely a game changer. Look at how beautiful that is. I mean, and the view of the road, wow. <laughs> Why, why have, why don't we have this for real? Why does it take a mod creator? I mean, like, listen, very talented mod creators, but like, we're the Sims team. <laughs> We trusted you. Plus the swatches, it's got like every wood tone you could possibly want. Hmm. The Sims 4 cannot relate. Oh, and we have doors too. Oh my god. Okay, so there's like this kind of door, which also is a full door, by the way. <gasps> oh my god, it comes on one tile and on two tiles so that you can center it on- They really think of everything. <laughs> because look, say I want to put a door right there, I could center it instead of having it being weird and like on the side. You could also make double doors if you wanted to, but the fact that you can center it, that genuinely is a game changer. Why don't we have that for everything in the game? <laughs> If we can place things on half tiles, that would be so helpful. I understand that we can't, but someday, maybe someday. I'm really easily impressed, as you probably can imagine. But look at these. This is what I saw in the preview and I was really excited about, because they have these doors that are like open air, and that functions as a door in the game. Your sims will walk through that. How beautiful is that? This is a door? How? Oh! It's like, well, I'm putting a sim here, hang on. Judah Boland, let's go. <laughs> we have to play test, this is very important. Wow, what a nice big house. Okay, now go inside. I'm really, oh! <gasps> Come back outside. <laughs> That's so cool. Go in this one. Oh. <laughs> Come outside. Stunning archway. Look at how tall that- oh, this is beautiful. I'm so excited. The way this works is a door, because you get a nice medium one, and then have some like nice medium wall height windows next to it, and it looks so normal, but really it's a door! Oh, that's amazing. Okay, it's the little things, you guys. Okay, we also have a million new items, but I think let's start by looking at the lighting, because that way we can- we don't have any more lighting, okay? <laughs> let's put some lights in here. We have this new wallpaper. That is so pretty. This is what we should have gotten with Get Famous. <laughs> the Get Famous stuff is so bad looking. Cause like this, it's nice, but it's so gaudy looking and just honestly horrendous. <laughs> but this looks really classy and upscale and like a thing you could actually use. Like it takes a very specific kind of sim to want that Get Famous wallpaper. Cause yeah, it's like a fancy marble, but it has the like golden trim and stuff. It's like, I'm not trying to build Versailles. I'm just trying to make 
a, a nice upscale modern bathroom. <laughs> and there's so many color options. Look at that. Even this one, that's really pretty. I like the white one. Wow. Okay, this is, see, you guys, oh, I'm so excited. I wish I used Build CC normally. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's take a look at this stuff. So we have a footstool, chair, lounge chair, that thing. <laughs> I like that thing. That's an ottoman, right? I'm assuming it'll function that way at least. Junior wall sink, master wall sink. Those are pretty. This one with the basin too. That. Have you ever seen a pedestal sink that looks good? Have you ever thought like, wow, <laughs> a pedestal sink? That's not true. I, I'm sure there are some pretty ones in real life. I just, my experience with pedestal sinks is like the tiny bathroom at my grandma's house with this like one that she probably put in in the 70s. And they're like, you can't like do anything with it because you can't, there's not even space for soap on the sink. Like it, it, it's really small. To be fair, that's kind of the vibe with this one too. But <laughs> it's very fancy and modern and cool. Look at that toilet. Magic. <laughs> they have an open shower and the shower unit. That shower is really pretty. Kind of needs to be against the wall, but like that's really nice. And then obviously, because with university we have these open showers, you can put one of those down. All right, we get it. We don't have any money. <gasps> the tub. Oh, this is what we've needed for so long. A fancy new, and look, you can get it in all the different colors, with all these different fixtures. Cause that's one of the problems with The Sims 4, I think, is that like you have this, maybe you want a black tub, but you don't want it to have this like white fixture. You want a gold fixture. Well, we have all the color variants you could possibly desire. <laughs> That's so pretty. Oh, I'm jealous. I want that in real life. <laughs> oh, look at this fancy looking modern planter box. This is just gonna be Simsy swooning for 20 minutes, by the way, so I hope you're prepared for that kind of video because that's what you're getting yourselves into. <gasps> it's a jar with plants in it. <laughs> okay, I know I'm not alone in getting the most excited about the dumbest clutter items. Like, oh, fancy tub, sure, but a jar of plants? You, it's the little things. The same thing goes on just in packs of CC, but like in real game packs, like when they actually add new game content to The Sims 4, like I am most excited for the clutter objects in Tiny Living. I know I'm not alone in this. <laughs> it's, it really is the little things. That, okay, this one is beautiful. This might be a favorite object in the game. With the yellow, oh, that's so pretty. I'm very easily won over. All you need is yellow <laughs> for me to like it. I'm, I'm serious. This too. Oh, I wish I, oh, I love this. I like that red pot. I like how they have all the marble colors on things too. That's so nice. Does it size down well? Yes. I'm so excited. I, I want to build something with this stuff right now. Okay, we have some walls of plants too, which is very exciting. They have small, <laughs> they have medium and large, which is so helpful because you could have like a full on wall of plants if you wanted, which obviously I do want. How fun. That looks really good. How are they this good at this? It's kind of offensive, honestly. You can't have it all. Shaving mirror. Oh, cool. Wait, see, it's the clutter things. It's the, <laughs> it really is the smallest things. Oh, that's so fun. I want that in real life. Okay, also this strap mirror. You can put it anywhere on the wall. The Sims 4 cannot relate. That is beautiful. I want this in the real game. Take notes, please, EA. You probably shouldn't just like steal their ideas, but you, come on. Okay, and we have some full-on mirrors too. Of course, we've got like the ones for all the different heights, the short, the medium, and the tall. And they have two tile ones. That's the thing. CC creators, they like cover all the bases with stuff. They've got all the swatches, all the variants of swatches. They've got the two tile, the one tile, the in between. <laughs> they do everything. <gasps> curtains. Oh my god, this, you had me at curtains. Wait, pretty sheer curtains. Oh, that's nice. See, and yet again, they've got like <laughs> the different widths, the different heights. They covered all the bases with the curtains. That looks so nice. Oh, clutter. <laughs> Gla wait, I'm sorry, glass dividers? That's so fun. Oh, <laughs> I'm so excited. And they have like the two wide ones and the one wide one. They have this one. Whoa, no, okay, this is really cool. I don't really like most of the dividers we have in the game, so I never use them. I could actually see myself using this. That's so pretty. And plus, it's so versatile because you could like put this on a wall, sort of, like alt place it and use it as a decorative thing. There's so many ways to use items like this. That's nice. <laughs> All right, let's see. Towel rack. Oh, <laughs> this is such a cute object. This is my favorite one. I'm not kidding. I love this. Also, we have better toothbrush holder. Like, that's so pretty. A candle! <gasps> and it lights! Oh! <sighs> and all the things ma- Look at this soap bar! That's so cute. See, it is- It really is the littlest things that I get the most excited about. Mouthwash! <laughs> Shampoo, conditioner, all of that. 
See, that's so fun. These little objects, like you can make such a realistic, pretty bathroom and stuff like that with, it's just the smallest things. And it's fun because this way when they're all separated, like if this were EA, <laughs> it would come as like one object that's like all of the things. It would be like all those things would be attached and then it's enormous and like you can't put it places. But this way you could like very easily just kind of snap like one little, you could just put some shampoo on the floor of the shower. That kind of ruins the vibe of a fancy shower, but you, you know what I mean. <laughs> face cloths! Look at the little face washies! <laughs> and they have actual towels too. And you can stack them. Look at this! I can have as many as I want. I love Bed Bath & Beyond. Amazing. <laughs> Ooh! Toilet paper holder. Okay, I'm sorry. I have one formal complaint. The toilet paper roll costs 75 simoleons. The bath towels cost 55 simoleons. You mean to tell me? that you can buy two fancy bath towels for 55 simoleons and one roll of toilet paper for 75. The in-game toilet paper that The Sims team has made is 50 simoleons and I rage every time I think about it. <laughs> and you can buy one for 75. It is a fancy toilet paper holder. This reminds me, I, okay, I follow a lot of house accounts on Instagram and one of the girls was doing like a Q&A, like answering questions about her house and things as they always do, they're like house accounts. And someone asked where she keeps her paper towels and so she showed off and like linked the, the paper towel holder she has. She's got, I kid you not, a $35 acrylic paper towel holder that she keeps under the sink. Why do you have to spend $35 on a piece of plastic to put under your sink? You can get them for like $5 or like $1 from the dollar store. If it's gonna be under the sink, it doesn't matter. I don't, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just can't imagine spending $35 on like a dump just to put it underneath the sink and never look at it. I'm, okay. Anyway. <laughs> It's so expensive. We have, uh, oh, the hand towel rack. Wait, oh my God, that, the things you never knew you needed until just now, that's amazing. Thank God. <laughs> I love how clean and like fancy and modern these things look. This is my dream. I'm so happy. <laughs> Absolutely worth the $5 I spent on this CC pack to get it early. And look at all the swatches. Like you can make such a different looking cool bathroom with these things. It's so fancy and modern and beautiful and I'm just so happy. <gasps> look! Oh my god! You guys! <laughs> I'm so excited about- it's- it really is the littlest things. This is amazing. Oh, you relax, sir, and you- and you look out at those cars as they drive by and they get jealous of you in your amazing bathroom. You might not have a house, but at least you have this thing. <laughs> Who is that? Quinn, I'm gonna be real. The accessory choices are bold. Everything you've done here with the the necklace and the glasses and the shoes and the the shirt colors there They really um they go very well together. Okay. <laughs> I'm very happy right now <laughs> Of course this pack of CC is linked down below if you want to check it out again It's not public access until February 5th But you can pay for it on patreon right now and you guys listen support your favorite CC creators If you have the money and you use their CC all the time Like they put a lot of effort into making stuff that we use a lot So if you have the ability drop a few bucks for them on patreon and follow these amazing ridiculously talented bathroom freaks <laughs> I'll link the kitchen CC pack they made down below too in case you want to download that one. That one's public right now. If you want to get it, you can just grab it already. Okay. <laughs> but like I said, I'm gonna go. Please make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe and do all those funny YouTube things. And in case you guys didn't know, I post new videos every single day. And so I will see you all tomorrow. Bye everybody. The fact that a bathroom has gotten me this excited. The fact that I got that excited about towels is it really says something. Shampoo and towels, and all of a sudden I'm near tears. Like, Lil Simsy is very easily impressed.